It's not every day you see a two-sport college student-athlete, but former Harlem Husky and UW-Milwaukee Panther Michaela Schmelzer did just that before taking her skills to the pitch overseas. 13 WREX's Ethan Wiles has more on her first pro season in Greece. Former Harlem Husky multi-sports star Michaela Schmelzer is back in the States following her first pro soccer season in Greece. Quite the adjustment joining a new team, a new country, and a new culture. It was different at first for sure, um, but I was quick to find my place there, which was nice. Um, the girls were so easy to connect with on and off the field, which helped a lot. Playing overseas also means adjusting to a new style of play. I feel like in the U.S. here, we prioritize more like the strength and conditioning side of stuff, whereas they're more crafty IQ um, in their game. It's a little slow. But it didn't take long for her to introduce her own style to the foreign competition. I am a little more athletic, a little more strong than everybody else. Uh, my first couple games I had a lot of fouls, um, which was good, but yeah, I slowly, you know, got used to it and it, it helps their team having someone else like me as well. She plans on returning to Greece soon, already planning on enjoying the sights and, of course, indulging in her favorite treat. They have so many coffee shops. Um, I love that about uh, Greece. Another favorite part of mine was the islands. They had a lot of islands there that you could visit, and it's absolutely beautiful. The soccer star is a natural on the court as well, returning home to represent women and her city, playing for the Rockford Lightning women's basketball team. I think it's great for women's sports, for one, and two, I think it's just awesome to see a random group of girls really to get together from the Rockford area and play together. Um, kind of showcase Rockford a little bit, get our name out there a little more, and just represent. And we'll have more on the Rockford Lightning coming up this Friday at 10 p.m. That's going to do it for sports. We'll be right back.